Welcome, Taurus. I'm back, y'all, with another video. So let's talk. Okay, so we got jumpers. Nine of Wands and a Six of Swords. Somebody's trying to... Somebody could be trying to block you out or you're trying to block somebody out. You're trying to avoid... You're trying to avoid something, okay? That's what it looks like. You could be trying to avoid something. Give me a message for Taurus, please. Y'all got jumpers. Somebody's taking something too far. Somebody's taking something too far. Something's going too far. Something's going too far. Something's going too far. Okay, so. We got the Empress and the Emperor, the Ten of Pentacles. Oh, wow. So I'm seeing the Empress and the Emperor here. So there is a couple here. There's a couple here. Baby mother, baby father, husband, wife, mother, father type of energy here. There's a twin flame energy here or soulmate connection or just a male and a female here. Both are very... Um, seem like they're higher up in level. I got Aquarius' this energy here, Cancer, Taurus, Aries. All right, so let's jump into it. This is a lot I see. Tell me why the Ten of Pentacles is here, because I'm going to jump all in this. Okay, the Queen of Wands just jumped out. When I see a queen of wands like this in a situation like this, I start to feel like maybe there's a third party involved. I see a lot of spying going on. So you could be spying on this situation. Like somebody's playing some games here. Tell me about this Queen of Wands energy. Leo Sagittarius Aries. I'm picking up on Sagittarius energy here. Yeah, okay. So somebody's dating. 
this fire sign here and they could be married. Okay. We got palm tree right here. Oh, wow. Okay. I, I just feel like you're spying on a situation here. I'm hearing what makes you think you can do that? Mm. What makes you think you can do that? You said that you were single and you was working on yourself. But really, you're married? You're a married man? Here's a third party. There's a third party in the picture. Um, you feel like this person getting away with this. And you could be waiting. You're waiting. It looks like somebody just doing, just out, just having a blast, just out having fun, just living it up, doing whatever they want to, sleeping with whoever they want to. Yeah, it's too much lying, cheating going on. It's too many secrets. Mm, okay. So, there's a third party that this emperor could be dating. This could be you. This could be vice versa. Someone else's energy. But I feel like you could be spying on this. You spying on this. Because I feel like with the Ace of Swords as the outcome is like some type of truth. You're finding out some type of truth. This person, this emperor, they just having a blast. I'm telling you. Like, they just having a blast. They just out here having a blast. It's like they want you to sit around. While they do what they want to do for a little while. Um, that ain't going to happen like that. Ooh, okay. Tell me about this emperor. This person, they are separated. They're separated from their wife. And they love to seduce other people. They like the attention. This is a third party interference. They like to hook up. They like to flirt. They could be working 
with this fire sign. Like they're in some type of contract or agreement. And this person loves to wear a mask. This person wear, is wearing a mask. They're not showing their true feelings. They hiding it. They personif personifying, pretending, gaslighting. They gaslighting this fire son who they're dating. They're telling them, like, yeah, we're going to take this to the next level. We gonna do this. We gonna do that. This fire sign could be a Sagittarius, but the challenge is temperance. It's like, dang, this is how, how. Yeah, this keeps happening. This is an ongoing thing. Somebody likes some young. We got the lovers in the Knight of Pentacles and the Knight of Wands. This person likes some young. They like them young. Younger. I ain't going to say like the child and stuff like that, but they like them younger. Yep, they cheat with younger women. Now, the chariot is here. Could be dealing with the cancer. Six of Wands. They're doing it for attention. They do it for the attention. They want to stay popping. They're trying to stay popular. They want all the attention. They want all eyes on them. They don't really love this person that they are seeing. They like the attention. And they go back. <laughs> Listen, I feel like you're just surprised that this person will fall for something like that. You were friends. You could have been friends with this person until you found out that they were like that. Ooh, yeah, they doing this for attention. Yep, they don't get attention. They're not getting the attention in their marriage. But they don't know. It's just make you stop wanting to do it. I feel like every time you find out a little bit more, it just make you stop wanting to do it. Yeah, it's like at one point the marriage was happy, but it's like, mm, not so much now. So this person is definitely stepping out and it's with someone younger it's like you could be trying to figure out how to make this person stop acting like this and make them come home and do the right thing. I'm definitely picking up on cancer energy. Yeah, like you're hoping that this person apologizes. Um, you feel like they ain't doing nothing but taking the money and running off with it. And it's like they don't realize that. you tired of feeling. you tired of this feeling. You feel like it's too risky. 
But I feel like you might have known about this for a while. The relationship is rocky. Your intuition. You've been listening to your intuition. And your intuition telling you. That is. I feel like somebody is like lying. Telling somebody that they're happy when they really aren't. Tell me about this Five of Swords energy. I'm getting a lot of jealousy, a lot of insecurities. Yep, I'm getting a lot of arguments. Could be over money. But we got the Tower and the Eight of Cups. You could be deciding to walk away. Could you... you they could be lying and telling you that this person making this up. They not... They're not telling the truth. The marriage is over. It ended. See, this is what they're telling this younger person that the marriage is over. It ended. It looked like it could start an argument, a disagreement. There's just too much going on. You, this is you. This is what you're seeing. For some of you, this not even really even your situation. This is something that you've been seeing. The Page of Swords and the Moon. You just, you've been seeing it. You may be wanting to tell the truth. But you know this is going to hurt their feelings. This person is not going to change. Yep. Ace of Wands and the Empress. This person definitely does have like a new friend. Um, like I said, this person is younger. They probably don't even ask for too much. They ain't got no standards. They don't ask for too much. They young. Could be a Leo. A Libra, Gemini, Aquarius as well. But she, she's young. Real young. And it's just like a lot of just, like I said, no standards. No morals. You feel like that. It's going to be a lot of regrets. I feel like this is something. It's going to be a lot of regrets when that truth come out. And this is something, I feel, like I said, this is something like you're, I feel like a lot of y'all on the outside looking in on the situation. For a lot of y'all, this is not your situation. But this is what's going on around you. Queen of Pentacles. They could be dating someone. Could be a Virgo Taurus Capricorn, but they could be doing it for the attention as well. And for some, it has something to do with finances. I told you. Like they're telling this person that they're separated. And then 
the relationship begin. I feel like this person was at first. At first, how it began, I feel like it started off slow. When it started off slow, um, it ain't it ain't happened quickly. It was something that was growing over time. Tell me about this Queen of Pentacles here. Passion, yep, that's the person that they've been sleeping with. Then we got girl with the snake. See, this girl get being used, empath and narcissist, being charmed or used, enable boundaries. She don't got no boundaries. She don't got no morals. She don't got no morals. She don't got no boundaries. just flew out we got addiction yeah this person is obsessed they got codependent issues obsession possession they controlling they can't restrain themselves they just girl can't even help herself and i told you it was a wedding we got wedding rings somebody is definitely married union wedding married soul connection eternal love everlasting promise so all they had to tell them is like, yeah, we, I'm, we separated. So yeah, we can, we can, we can mess around. We we separated, not divorced, but separated. All right. So this person was deciding to take it slow at first. They was taking it moving real slow at first because they thought they was gonna regret it. They want to see who's watching, who who going to figure it out. Who going to take the bait? Look at this. This mother. <laughs> this person is definitely toxic as hell. This definitely could be a Capricorn. Who going to take the bait? They want to see who is going to take the bait. Now, we got the seven of cups here. This person got plenty of options. Plenty of options. Plenty of people who they do this to. They just wanted to see who was going to take the bait. Who was going to take the bait? They're surprised it took them that long. But they wanted to have a reason to leave. Hmm. Why is the Seven of Pentacles here? Ooh, the world. I feel like you're kind of like waiting for this to this cycle to close. Yeah. Um, you're waiting for a new energy to come in. Somebody got married when they were young. Um and I just feel like you could be just kind of like waiting for this energy to sizzle, fizzle out and, and waiting for something new to come in. Yeah, because you feel like that's that's what needs to be done, justice. You feel like that's going to even out the score. Yeah, but once that truth get out, Ace of Swords and the Queen of Swords, when that truth get out that this is a married man. Because, see, he, he run around telling people that he not married. Messing with this younger girl, this young lady here. Mm, ain't no coming back from that. Mm, ain't no coming back from that. 
I feel like this song, I feel like you want to just blurt it out. And like I said, for some of y'all, this is not even your situation. For some of y'all, this is a friend or somebody that you're close to because I see y'all doing a lot of, like y'all, it looks like y'all on the outside looking in on the situation. Could be a Gemini. When you when they see who this person really is, cause see, you already know. You already know who this person is. You already know. Him. For some of you that are married to this person, you already know you don't you been married to him for, for a long time. This person gonna end up crying, but ain't nobody gonna feel no sympathy because a lot of people already know this person. A lot of people already know this person way. A lot of people already know that this person was married. It's like how you ain't knew he was married. Everybody know he was married. Everybody know that's what he do. Ooh yeah, he like him young. He like him younger. And that third party could definitely be a Leo that this person keeps running back to. I'm telling you, you you've been spying on this. You seen this. You're you're watching this person. For a lot of y'all, I think it's the a Capricorn. This person is married. This person is married. They're married. All right. So y'all let me know what's going on in the comment section below. And I will chat with y'all later. Ciao for now.